All right, um, good morning students. We're gonna be making a 3D paper star. Um, so all you need is one piece of paper that is in a rectangle. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold it. Um, you're gonna fold it like a triangle and then you're gonna cut the extra piece off of the edge. Um, so this piece here, we're just gonna cut. And then we are going to have a triangle. Um, so once you have this big triangle, you're gonna fold this triangle in half. Um, so we've got the triangle here. We're gonna fold this triangle in half. And then we're gonna fold the triangle in half again. Okay, so you're gonna have an even smaller triangle. Then you're gonna open this up and you're going to see that it looks kind of like a kite. And what you're gonna do is <clears throat> on this line here, you're going to make a line that goes about 25% up on the page. And in the middle here, you're gonna make a line going up. And here, you're going to make a line going up. And here, you're gonna make a line going up. And then you're gonna cut these lines. Okay, so once you cut these in the center, on every single side, Then, and you wanna make sure that they're about the same length. Um, and then you're gonna fold them in, kind of like a paper airplane. Um, and I've got some extra lines here because I'm using a scrap piece of paper. Um, but this is gonna look kind of like an airplane on every single side. And if you don't have white paper, you could use a brown paper bag. Um, you can use recycled paper. You could use also construction paper. Um, so basically you're just gonna get all these folded in the same way. And then um, you're going to fold this again. So you're going to get that crease a bit stronger in the middle. And then you're gonna fold it again. And then when you open it, you will have a star. Um, so if you want to, you can make two of these and you can overlap them and tape them so that um, you've got a more 3D um, star, so it has more dimension. And then you could hang this up. Um, so this is our lesson for today. Thank you for joining me.